Hi, YouTube family. This is Franny's Ethnic and Southern Cuisines. I'm sitting here thinking, you know, and I was like, wow, I need to share because I have people coming up to me every day at work saying, Joyce, why is it you look so young and what are you doing? And wow, when I grow up, I'm going to be just like you. And this is what I hear. So I'm, I know that I'm doing something right, okay? It lets me know I'm doing something right. Okay, so I wanted to share with you guys what exactly it is that I do to take care of myself. One, excuse me, I have high blood pressure. So I really have to take care of myself to make sure that I'm doing everything right. That's one, okay? Two is that as you get older, you have to replace certain vitamins that your body no longer produces just from food, okay? When you're younger, younger, your body produces a lot of vitamins that help you out. But as you get older, it produces less of those vitamins. So one is melatonin. So I found that I was having a hard time sleeping at night. And I did, and I, my doctor had prescribed me a medication that left me with such a hangover. I didn't want to take it anymore. It was Ambien. That stuff had me crazy the next day. So I told my son, I said, I can't take this. It's too strong. And it has me hungover the next day. And I feel like I'm dragging. So he said, Mom, let me explain it to you. And he broke it down to me. He said, your body naturally produces melatonin. But as you get older, it produces less melatonin, which means that you have to replace the melatonin so that you can sleep. So I take melatonin to help me sleep at night. Also, I take a regimen of vitamins, okay? So I'm going to explain each one of these vitamins to you as I'm showing it to you. I want you guys to know that I am 60 years old. I have five biological sons and several adopted sons. Io, Alex, uh, Jamaica, uh, uh, Adaryl, uh uh, Dylan, I have a, uh, uh, I have so many. Okay, I have a lot of adopted sons that look up to me. Okay, and Cody, you know, I have a lot of Eric, Teddy. Osgood. These are all boys that spent a lot of time in my house. Okay? So, along with my five boys, I raised so many other kids. And it kept me young because I was busy with them. They was, they was coming home with my kids after football practice and track practices and proms and uh, um, everything they was going through and I was there, okay? And it was fun. I really missed those days. But, so I'm going to share you with you guys the vitamins that I take, okay? So bear with me. I'm going to walk you through it and I'm going to explain each one of them to you so you'll know what I'm taking, okay? Okay, here we go. Okay, let's start here. This right here is for bone health okay it has calcium and it has d3 in it okay okay now if you are a drinker and you love to drink and i love my wine every now and then i like my brandy and i want to make sure i keep my liver cleansed so here you go liver refresh i take that D3 and K2. 
D3 is the vitamins that you would get from the sun. Um, I don't know what's happening here lately. I, I became a little bit lighter than normal. Uh, I don't know if it's genetics. I don't know what it is, but hey, it's okay. I embrace who I am. So the D, the D3 is going to help with my skin. Um, and just just being all around healthy. The K2 is for people who don't eat enough green vegetables. So that's a good vitamin to have. To have. Now, mind you, I've gotten a lot of these at the health food store. I'm going to be changing this one because it's supposed to be a complete vitamin. But I need a prenatal vitamin. So look at it like this, you guys. If you're taking a prenatal vitamin when you're pregnant, right? I want y'all to look at me. If you're taking a prenatal vitamin when you're pregnant and it's giving you all the vitamins and nourishments you need for you and your unborn child, your hair grows, your nails grow, that is a vitamin that you need to continue to take in even after pregnancy, okay? So that's what I take. A lot of my, I've talked to a lot of my friends into taking prenatal vitamins. They're very good for you and they're healthy for you too, okay? I am severely anemic. I had a spell where I passed out because of low blood. I'm anemic, okay? Uh, so, but the problem I was having is that the iron pills that I was taking was constipating me. So I found this one's called Gentle Iron. It's only 25 milligrams. So I'm taking that as well. And my niacin. Niacin is good for your nails, your hair, your skin. It's just all around a good vitamin. It's probably responsible for what's uh, giving me my skin health. The reason why I'm lightening up so much because it is really good for hair, nails, skin, it's a good vitamin to have. And I also take a vitamin for my eyes as well, okay? So I'm telling you guys, if you're growing older, you need to replace supplements. You, you have to take supplements. Your life really depends on, look here, look. Okay, look, this is me, okay? This is me. I take care of myself. Mm, my lips are dry. Hold on, let me give me a drink of water. Mm. And that's another thing. I want to get off the medications because if I can get off the blood pressure medication, my mouth be dry all the time. And one time I did get off of it, Right before the pandemic, I was off of medications, but I couldn't exercise. I couldn't go to the parks. If you remember, they closed the parks, so I couldn't go. So that's just something I wanted to share with you guys. I need you to like, share, subscribe to my channel. Um, hit the bell so when I upload a video, you will be able to see it. Um... My cash app is pent below. I do ask for donations so I can continue to bring you guys this content. Um, if you want to donate, you can. It really will help with me purchasing food so I can cook for you guys. Um, just a dollar. You know, two dollars. Just two dollars. You know, donate that. And two dollars will add up from 128 subscribers. Thank you guys. That's where we at now with 128 subscribers. And I know it's going to take time for us to get where we need to be. But y'all don't give up on me. I promise you guys, I will be back in the kitchen right now. I'm just, you know, kind of taking care of my husband. He has not been well. So I'm trying to take care of him right now. What I want you to know that if you're not having a good day, don't mess with nobody else's day, okay? Because today is the first day of the rest of your life. Don't mess with nobody's day. Just have a good day. And I'll see you guys in the kitchen. Love you.
Thanks, new subscribers. Stick with me. I promise you I won't let you down.